Welcome back to another episode of Passion Beer. Nick here with Shane, and uh, Shane busted out one of my uh, one of my beers finally. I did finally. Uh, finally, Nick's uh, actually uh, contributing something uh, to these video reviews. <laughs> so so what we got Nick. Uh, I have a Goose Island Sophie, uh, 2010. Yep. So it's got some age to it uh, because it is June 2012. <laughs> yes, it is. Yes, it um, is. It's a 80% of it is a uh, Belgian style ale uh, mixed in with a 20% Belgian style ale aged in wine barrels with some orange peels. So uh, yep. should be an interesting take. And like I said, this has set a little bit. It has. So, uh, so on Beer Advocate, they're they're calling it a Saison farmhouse. Okay. Um, I mean, somewhere probably in the Belgian pale ale, uh, Saison, something along those lines. So but definitely a nice pale, kind of yellowy orange color. I mean, a little bit of haze in there. A little bit nice, of nice, nice. A little habit. bit of orange. I mean, um, mainly a yellow. For saisons, I really like that kind of fluffy. It look, kind of looks like a soapy, lots of bubbles, white head, bright white head. Oh, uh, that's the residue from the glass. No, I'm <laughs> no, I mean it's a, it's a, it is a really, really nice looking beer. It's, it's got like, that saison quality for the aroma. It's to got it. saison. It's got a little bit of like funk, almost like there's Brett in here, but I don't really think there is. No, I think a lot of that might might have to do with the citrus. Yeah, there's definitely uh, and the wine citrus, barrels. almost like a chalkiness that I kind of get too. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it's definitely really uh, good, interesting. Yeah, you want to take a sip? I will. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Ooh, that's good. That's surprisingly good. It's got a lot, a lot of things going on for it. I, you know what? I was hesitant. I was like, man, this has been sitting there for a little too long. I don't know if it's going to be any good. But oh, that's nice. th this is fantastic. I, I, this is perfect for the summertime, especially. Yeah, it's really crisp. It's got a nice citrus undertone. It's got a nice saison, almost like a. I don't want to really say it's tart, but it almost has like a flick of like a little oh, yeah. tart or funkiness or something in there. I, I, it's almost like a funky saison. Yeah, type, exactly. Yeah. Type style going on with it. I mean. As much as it says Belgian style L on the front, it, it, it definitely is more in the Saison family. Definitely. Um, it's nice. It's nice, bright citrus. I mean, it's a little bit of lemon, a little bit of orange. It's really nice. I, I really like it a lot. It's actually really <laughs> freaking good. Yeah, I mean, and, and for a 2010 bottle, I mean, normally, you know, I, I, I kind of those think of Saisons, disappear, though. Yeah, and I unless mean, it's like kind of infected with the Brett or whatever, and those will develop over time. But I don't think this one is, although it kind of has those characteristics. But I think a lot of it, really with, with the Saison accents to it, a lot of it has to do with the Belgian style of yeast that's used. Yeah. So, I mean, you do get a lot of those qualities from the yeast and with, with it able to sit in the barrel, uh, the bottle, yep. excuse me, and uh, be able to overtake some of those other flavors that were right. present as soon as it was bottled. Now, it definitely does say uh, develops in the bottle for up to five years. So, I mean, it's, <laughs> oh, it, it's just, it is a good aging candidate. That, that's what I read when I left <laughs> oh, yeah, the yeah. closet. <laughs> Overall, I'm probably going to have to clock in and give this a 92. I, I mean, this is, this is great. I mean, th there are some other different accents that I'd like to see. Um, I mean, you advertise it as a Belgian style Al. I'd probably like to see a little bit more uh, towards the sugary side, uh, a little bit heavier malt accent to it but I mean as a saison this is fantastic yeah definitely um, I, I'm kind of bordering on that 91 92 I'm gonna just give it a 91 I, I mean I think all the qualities are are there for a really good saison farm farmhouse ale and uh, you know the fact that this has been sitting for what almost two years now I mean it really really held up well obviously we haven't tried it fresh so we don't know what it tasted right. like then but two years down the road it's awesome it really is awesome it drinks like a very fresh just bottled Saison. And, and it was before great. the buyout, so... Uh. Yeah, <laughs> it was. That's true. I'll, I'll have to pick up another one of these and uh, get Do it out of test world. There but a uh, special shout out to Justin. Thank you uh, for bringing this my way. I appreciate it. Absolutely. And you know what? Thank you for sharing it. Hey. I mean, uh, another Goose Island beer I've never had and always always willing to try something. And thank you for you uh, to you for tuning in. Greatly appreciate it. We'll see you guys next time. Cheers. Cheers.